Also, wir machen Raperia, erste Akt, stille Nacht, Tag des Gerichts. Geht zum Bezirk Lyonnais am Hof von Fontaine. Am Hof von Fontaine. Auf der Straße am Hof von Fontaine scheinen zwei vertraute Gestalten deine Hilfe zu brauchen. Hey, yo, what's poppin'? Hm. Still no dice? Still no dice? Uh, not at all. Good. And I've asked pretty much everyone in the court of Fontaine already. Lynette's ears drooped as soon as she heard that we'd have to be out and about for days on end. And Fremene, uh, he hid himself under his helmet as soon as he realized there'd be people around that he didn't know. Hm. What about Chiori and Charlotte? I feel like both of them will be more than up to it. Gern geschehen. I've asked them already, but they're both pretty busy right now. I just gave the members of the Spina a few days off too, so I don't want to bother them either. Hmm, this is getting pretty difficult. Nadia, Clarine, what's up? Oh my! <laughs> well, if it isn't my dear partners, how are you all doing? Huh. Navia? Huh? Oh, you mean... Yep, this is our chance. Was habt ihr vor? Wir sind nur auf der Durchreise. Do you need our help with something? Oh, precisely. My dear partners, we've got a huge problem right now that only you can solve. Whoa, for real? Absolutely. We've already exhausted all our other options. Hast du für ein Problem, lass mal hören. Traveler, Paimon. Would you join us and play Mar Chose Hunter Judgment Day? Okay. Mar Chose what now? It's a new game script by the Tabletop Troop, a local roleplay adventure club. Ever heard of the Tabletop Troop? They put out games that allow you to participate in a story and roleplay characters with your friends. Oh, I've nerds? loved their stuff ever since I was a kid. Redet sie gerade über Nerds? Super interesting! Clorand and nerds. I are both veteran members of the club. Recently, someone came up with a new script and was looking for people to help playtest it for them. Man. And when they asked, of course I couldn't refuse. <laughs> I mean, come on! A brand new script? Nobody has ever played it before. Mm -hmm. Generally speaking, scripts at that level of development have a lot of issues, but I think this one is pretty solid. The author obviously put a lot of work into the story, and the world building is also quite credible. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. I know I was the one that handed you the script, but some of us haven't read it yet. No spoilers, please. <laughs> anyway, the script calls for a team of four. Ah, yes. We're missing one final player right now. Ja, Paimon. Stimmt, das ist echt ein echtes Problem. So, you're saying you'll help us out? I knew I could count on you, partner. Wie sie einfach Paimon ignorieren. Paimon and the Traveler are kind of a package deal. Is that okay? That's not a problem. I'll adjust the pace based on the actual number of players and ensure that everyone has a good time. Well, Traveler, what do you think? Wanna play? Paimon will follow your lead. Ich freue mich auf das großartige Skript. Well, that solves our problem. You have our thanks. Woohoo! I'll go grab the script manager from the club right away. The script manager? Didn't you just say that you gave Claren the script? The club introduced a completely new kind of gameplay for the script. In this iteration, the Game Master's version of the script is incomplete. The script manager provides the next part of the script only after players have completed the current list of objectives. On top of that, in order to increase player immersion, the club has created some of the story's sets and scenes in real life. We'll only know where we should go once the script manager reveals the starting location. Wow, this is a bit right. aufwendig. Whoever wrote this script really did put in a lot of work. <laughs> and it's got a real healthy amount of suspense, right? I mean, even the GM doesn't know how the story will end. I look forward to experiencing it with you all. Why don't you go meet up with the others first? They should all be waiting at Chioria Boutique. I'll come over with the script manager as soon as I find them. Sounds good. Remember to always watch where you're going, and don't rush. Oh, 
You say that like I'm six years old or something. <laughs> hmm, let me think. What kind of character should I play this time? I just hope you'll pick up some useful skills this time. Oh, and stop trying to persuade every animal you come across. Klingt ja sehr spannend, mit ein paar Nerds Brettspiele zu spielen. No Front gegen Nerds. Aber es klingt jetzt wirklich nicht sehr spannend. Sorry to keep you waiting. Ah, you're back! And you've got the Traveler and Paimon with you too! What a Torina and Linny. I assume you'll be joining us for the game then. Linny, Farina! Paimon didn't know you were playing too! Are you also members of the tabletop troupe? Hmm, I'm more of a casual member, if anything. I haven't taken part in many formal club activities. Lynette Fremenet and I play something similar at the Hotel Bouffe Tete sometimes, but I'm usually the GM. Still, I'm sure it'll be fun being a player for the first time. I'm looking forward to it. Well, I'm not a member of the club at all. Cloran simply woke me up first thing this morning, said there was a good script worth experiencing, and asked if I wanted in. If you're interested, I can give you a referral. That should give you a 40% discount on membership fees. I think I'll wait to see how this experience plays out first, especially when it comes to the quality of the script. If it's sufficiently fun, then I'll join. Do you participate in a lot of tabletop troop activities, Clarine? You could say that. She's actually one of the few senior game masters of the troop. Ah, right. I knew about that even when she was still my subordinate. Uh, <laughs> it's nothing. Really, just a small hobby of mine. Wow. Nerd. I'm so used to seeing you be all upstanding and intimidating as the champion duelist. It's kind of hard to imagine you role playing with a bunch of friends. Also, wenn wir ein Problem mit einer deiner Regeln haben. Dann können wir, ein, die, können wir eine Duell-Anfrage bei dir einreichen. Surely you jest. I would never intentionally make things difficult for my players. I maintain a clear boundary between my professional and personal lives. The me you see at court represents the law and order of Fontaine. I put all law and order Fontaine. Aside and grant a fair duel to all who seek to defend their honor. Jetzt auf Fox. But in my personal life, I'm just an ordinary person. Someone who feels anger and sadness, just like everyone else. Well, you say that, but for all the time I've known you, I don't think I've ever seen you cry. I've seen you get angry, sure, but now I'm wondering whether you were actually mad or if it just looked that way from the outside. Uh, I was probably in work mode during those times. Is that so? Well, in any case, I just feel like even in your personal life, you don't get emotional very often. So you want to see me cry? That might be a little difficult. A show of anger, though. That might be something I could accomplish. <laughs> no, that's not what I meant. Erstmal Chlorin zum Heulen bringen. Let's go. Ich weiß, was meine Aufgabe ist. Eine meiner leichtesten Übungen. Wenn ich das mal so sagen darf. Ah, I'm back. Here, allow me to introduce you to the script manager, Mr. Florian. Pleasure to meet you all. Servus. Oh, uh, wait, are you a champion duelist too, Mr. Florian? Oh, no. This is just the costume provided by the club. I occasionally play a few of the roles in my scripts. That sounds like a lot of work. It's nothing. It's the least we can do to give the players a more immersive experience. Anyway, allow me to give you a brief introduction of the script. This script was adapted from the real history of the Maro Chaussee Hunters. You all will play the role of hunters from a bygone era and resolve a series of events unfolding in the capital. Um, Paimon's not super familiar with the history of the Maro Chaussee Hunters. Is that a problem? Steinmann hat die 20% aufgeladen, damit mit der Wecker nicht wegstirbt. Und das Ding ist mega warm geworden. Rip. Oh, no problem at all. I can give you a brief rundown. So, basically, 
Mara Shosei hunters were people who dedicated themselves to hunting monsters and protecting the city by using a special swordsmanship technique passed down over generations. Their story can be traced back to the ancient Remurian dynasty, as well as the first hunter, Cassiodor. But I'll leave the finer details for you to seek out and discover later. Went my Cassiodor? Think in video. And I'll provide additional commentary as the story progresses. In that case, <clears throat> that's my boy. Brave hunters, are you ready to set out on an unknown adventure? Yep. Oh, just one sentence, and it's like we're in the story already. Uh huh. I see many a determined gaze before me. Very well. Head over to this location and begin your heroic journey. So, as we follow so, the story, it leads us to specific scenes. Ooh, sounds pretty innovative. What does the message in the envelope say? It's the exact location of the scene, as well as the formal permission to use the venue. Huh, seems like they have everything prepared. Please check all your belongings, everyone, and make sure you haven't forgotten anything. Once you're ready, please follow me to the designated location. Sounds good. Hunter Squad, move out! Tag des Gerichts, das war's schon, das war Teil 1.